Hey, we're back in Edna and Harvey's universe. Uh, the breakout. We are playing the anniversary edition, which is just a more polished version of the the, the original. So that's what we're gonna go with. Cause if I can get better graphics and stuff, then yeah, sign me up. Uh, so I've already played the sequel, the Harvey's New Eyes. So I'm doing this kind of in uh, the wrong order, but I didn't know it was a sequel. So if you haven't seen that yet, I do have the whole finished playthrough uh, on my channel. But do follow this one first though, if you haven't seen the other one yet. Um, so I am very excited. I love the Harvey's new eyes, so I'm probably gonna enjoy this one as well. And without any further ado, let's do this. Alright, a new game. Yes. <laughs> ah, this is adorable. Man. So what are we... Oh, this is just an intro thing. Okay. Oh, I forgot to check on the language stuff. I might have to change that. We'll see. Is that Dr. Marcel? Looks like him. Oh man! Oh what? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> what? Oh, okay, yeah, right. Cause she's insane, right? Wait, have we started? No. Okay, no, not yet. What's going on? Yeah, that's structure more. So oh, nothing. Doopie 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 doo. <laughs> okay. The breakout. So we're breaking out of the asylum. Definitely. All right. So this is slightly different from the other game, I think. Um doesn't look half bad to have upholstery on the walls. Talk to pad. Are you the sound absorbing type of padding? <laughs> What's going I'll on? take that as a yes. Oh man, you don't have any pads, Edna. Dude, that's embarrassing. I'd like one of those for my deck. I Man, turn around and I don't want to see your underwear. I can't seem to remember She's probably anything. like 14. Damn, this is not child friendly. Oh, I can touch it? <laughs> <laughs> this is great. I love this. I can't reach between the gaps with my fingers. Oh, well. Wow. Oh, shit. Just leap, I guess? Psh. Even though a door comes in handy time and time again. I can't stand this one in particular. Yeah, I guess I understand that. Um, Not without consulting my interior decorator. Of course. Oh, there's the default action. What's the default my most action? Generous hosts have granted me a whole a tier. whole tier, man. That's so cool. I'd like one of those for my deck. All right. Um, I wonder if I even had a deck. I can't seem to remember anything. Let's talk um, to Harvey. Hello? Hello, Edna. What's up? Oh, shit. Um, what is, what this, is place? this place? I have no idea, but I want to get out of here. Same. Me too. It seems to be some kind of asylum. This must be a misunderstanding. Who the heck are you? Who the heck are you? And what? You can speak? I'm your buddy, Harvey. It's a shame you don't recognize me. 
I'll help you get out of here and try to restore your memory. Yes. How's it going, How's Harv? How's it going, Harv? I'd be much better if we were out of here already. I'll go and have a look around then. I already Maybe have done that. I can find a way out of here. I wonder what the padding is for. Sound insulation, I guess. You mean no one can hear us in here? It's still worth a try. Maybe if we just keep screaming, something will happen you cut eventually. It out of there. Great idea. I suppose I'll free myself by looking at this chair again. <laughs> oh, the sass. Now that is interesting. The legs are detachable. Wait, so I... Okay, I so... Those from my deck. So default can be a good thing to do then. I wonder if I even had a deck. I can't... Well, then... Uh, oh, because there is a chair and chair leg. Right. Well, detach it Let's then. Let's see how detachable this chair leg Come really on, is. Come on, you can do it. Yes. Now, we can reach... Uh, use that one. Yes. And, uh... Use that one. Um... <laughs> hmm. That doesn't work that way. I don't know how it works. Now you can reach in there, or some shit. I can't reach between the gaps with my fingers. Now we'll use the thing! Doesn't look half bad to have upholstery on the walls. Are you supposed to like open the door with it? Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh shit, that's a lot of pets. How did that... Okay, so spacebar shows... Why didn't I get any tutorials type of thing? Just gotta figure out everything myself, huh? Let's try and use it on the pad. That didn't do much now, did it? No. If only I had something pointy. What would that be? Uh, let's use it on the chair. I don't know. No, oh fuck, that was very dumb of me. Uh... Please do not without consulting my interior decorator. What? Yeah. There you go. And uh oh. Let's see. If I apply the chair leg back here, and with a little bit of leverage. Oops. What? I broke it. Well now it's pointy, and that's very good. So now we can, I don't know. Um. What are we doing? Should I've we done do enough slashing for now? No, you have not. We're just going to slash everything. What do you want? I want out of here. Forget it. God what damn it. What kind of way is that to treat a guest? We won't so get that easily, rude. will we? Hey. Hello. Don't make so much noise in there. What do you want? Oh, shit. Something happened. Um. Uh. <laughs> Where am I? Where am I? Honey, if I answered that question every time one of you loonies asked me, so I wouldn't even have time rude. to go to the bathroom Oh anymore. my god. <laughs> Listen, honey, I'm not paid for talking. Anything else? Oh yeah. Who am I? Who am I? You are by far the most annoying patient I've ever had to guard. <laughs> Feel so patient? bad, man. Am I sick then? I certainly don't feel sick. Listen, sweetie, you're in a room with padded walls. Yeah, and Why I cut all of it, huh? Figure it out for yourself. 
I'm not insane. I'm not insane. Isn't that so, Harvey? <laughs> she isn't insane. Do you hear? Harvey agrees. Yeah, take that. <laughs> you really are an odd couple. The both of you. <laughs> Why can't I remember anything? I'm not going to explain that to you yet again. Only so you can forget it during your next treatment again. Oh my god, what are they doing to her? Poor girl. Why is it so hot in here? That might be due to the air conditioner being turned off. What air conditioner? There's no air conditioner in here. <laughs> Do you think the doctor is stupid enough? Oh, so to that's have an what's in that ventilation gash shaft in your thing. cell? <laughs> turn up thing. The air conditioner is hidden behind the padding, of course. <laughs> is that so? Oh, really? Did just An tell air me. Air conditioner behind the padding. That does make much more sense, of course. <laughs> well, turn Can it you on. Turn please. on the AC for me, please. I'll have to think about that. Please. If you keep quiet from now on, maybe later. Let yeah. me out. This is an emergency. Oh, is it? It's much too hot in here. You can take it. No. I'm hungry. Dinner's at six. So I guess if I start it's screaming again, maybe he'll get, get tired of it and turn again. it on. It's free choice day at the cafeteria, you know. I need to check what the weather is like. Well... The early autumn sun is resting low in an orange sky. The air is so clear that the distant light is sparkling in the mountain reflections. Sounds nice. It's around 65 degrees Fahrenheit. It's a lovely day outside. But you won't be able to <laughs> see, see it, I'm stay afraid. Stay inside. Wee. Damn. I'm a bit dizzy. Well, that's probably because of the stale air in there. I suppose I could get up now. Walk over to the controls of the yeah. AC and provide you with some fresh air. That would be air. very nice of you. But then again, maybe I won't. Such a bitch. I have to pee. Ah, the good old I have to pee trick. Truly a classic. Do you honestly think you get to be a warden in an asylum for the insane if you ever fall for that one? What if I really have to pee? Yeah, yeah, very clever. Well, I mean, what if she does have to pee? I really have to seriously, urgently go pee. Don't try that with me. Just don't. It's much too hot in here. You can take it. Um, okay. Oh, I'm mistaken. No emergency at all. That's even better. Anything else? I couldn't help but notice how skillfully you're guarding this door. Huh. There's a I lot of talking that, eh? options so here. So you might have also noticed that I have my own technique. I developed it at the last tournament. Yep. Really? So you're a famous athlete? Do you play on a team or something? Oh. <laughs> I feel like I, if we butter well, him up, he I might turn golf. it on for us. Mini golf. Oh, mini yep. golf. Damn, son. That's pretty cool. Wow. <laughs> mini golf? I'm getting all dizzy. Yeah, that's pretty with cool. With good reason, sweetheart. You know what? <laughs> I'll turn on the AC for Really? You. you can cool off a bit that way. Yes! Nailed it! See, buttering up people always work. Then, tear it open, honey. There seems to be a passage behind this particular cushion. Then, um, open it? There seems to be a passage behind this particular cushion. Yeah, well, uh, should I try and tear it up even more? Maybe? Yes! Woo! So we can just use that on those, though, right? 
Great doesn't seem to be impressed. Quite the contrary, in fact. It seems to be mocking me. That's very rude. Yeah, 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 the screws, right. Um, it's a flathead chair leg, but a Phillips screw head. What? I could just cry, Harvey. I can't loosen these screws. Ah, oh, come on. You should be able to eat screws like that for breakfast. That certainly wouldn't have stopped you when you were little. What do you mean by that? Well, you used to be able to pull off a pretty cool trick. Tell me about it. Uh... Could I... Teleport? Could I teleport? Not exactly that. But a couple of stupid screws would never have been an obstacle for you. I must have been an extra laid-back kid. <laughs> what else do you know? Um... That isn't how it works. Just remember, I'm a projection of your subconscious. Dale. Nobody's perfect. I can give your memory a boost. But you'll have to show me things that remind you of your childhood. I don't really like have screws? a lot of Exacto mundo. And then? Then oh. I'll tempo morph us to the past. Ooh. Cool. <laughs> yeah, that is cool, man. <laughs> well, then do that. Uh... Look at the screws. I'm ready, Harvey. Yes, let's Shall go. Shall I tempo morph you to the past now? Yes. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. Tempo morph me to the past. As you wish. Hold on. Oh, man. It's going to be good. Oh, my God. She is so cute. <laughs> so this is the past? It looks like our old basement, at least. And look at me! I'm young and adorable! We've jumped back about ten years! Don't I have to be careful now that I don't run over my own grandpa or something? No more than usual. We're just observing your memory here. Ah, I see. So I don't have to be careful in case I step on some dinosaur eggs. Not if you can find any. <laughs> I know what day this is. My father locked me up in the basement because I teased the neighbor's boy. His name Rude. was... Albert, or... Alfred. I mean, the locking up Alfred in the basement Marcel. thing, that is. Alfred Marcel? Like in Dr. Marcel? Oh, no. You better believe it. What? He's the son of the doctor in charge of the asylum. Whoa. But this shouldn't be a concern for us. We're here to teach you the art of loosening screws without a tool. All right, then. Hmm. I have to get my bearings first. So he has first. a vendetta I'll against first, us. If you don't is what mind. I'm hearing. We can take turns, okay? Okay. There's so many options here, man. Maybe Edna will know what to do with the oil. I should ask her. Oh, I'm I'm playing as the rabbit right now. Maybe we can open the door with the oil from the can. Why would that be nice an option? Nice idea. But there isn't any oil. Go. <gasps> this is the last piece in this puzzle. I'm sure <laughs> of it. So let's get back to that later. Um, let's take the rake. I wonder if Edna can use this thing. The music here is so fucking cute. Can you reach the window with a rake? Hmm. This almost sounds like it could work. I could give it a try, if you let me. Go for it. Hmm, the window is closed. I might be able to squeeze through, but I can't do it without Edna's help. What's that? Is that like going back? Oh, I can change. I didn't know that. I must have uh, not paid attention to that part. Well, try and climb it. Oh, what? So I can actually just grab everything? I can't even get a drop out of it. 
Well, we were supposed to try and climb out of the window, so let's try that. It's already open. Yeah, but I gotta climb it. Its primary function is to rake leaves. It's far less effective as a tool for fine mechanics. Have you tried it, though? There are certain differences between a rake and a key. Locked. What else could it be? The screws are keeping a panel in place. I wonder what's behind it. Let's find out, gang. Let's see if I can make out anything. Oh, sure. Wow, that's our old kitchen. Oh, that's so cute. This site alone was worth trying this temple morph thingy. Oh. Can you go um, out? Edna? Will you help me up there? Just for a second? Those really? Yeah, I think I can manage. Oh, cool. Yes! We made it out! Hell yeah. Nope. There ain't no monkeys in there. Oh, I thought it said money, and I was like, what? Are we looking for money? What happened to that? Nope. There ain't no monkeys in there. No, sir. Let's go to the neighbors. Or not? No? Okay. Fine. Oh, wait. Can we? Ooh! Oh, there's somebody sitting there! The guy on the left is Mattis, Edna's father. But on the right... Hey! Isn't that Alfred Marcel? I remember him, but I Dr. don't remember Marcel, him. The head of the asylum! Edna had to play with him a lot back then. But why is he sitting here eating ice cream with Mattis when Edna's locked inside? I don't get it! Oh, something strange with that, huh? What? The infamous Chisnes thief escaped from custody. Police seems that on Thursday he managed to open the school. Is this interesting? It says that the chestnut burglar has escaped again. We'll have to watch our chestnuts closely now. Just a For second. Sure. This is interesting. What? It says he escaped by using a chewed off toenail. Hmm. hmm. <laughs> this says that you're allowed to rhyme easel with brush. Yippee! That oversight was long overdue. In Flint, Michigan, a left handed person was stabbed with a right handed pair of scissors. Very strange. So strange, man. The chestnut burglar has escaped again. Maybe Edna can learn something from him. Maybe. Did that uh, get on the menu thing then? Yes. Let's go talk to Edna about that. And hopefully that'll do something. Guess what? The chestnut burglar has escaped again. And so can oh, you. Oh no, not again. Last time he took three trees in our street alone. Oh, man. Police are saying that he escaped using a chewed off toenail. So can you. Really? Hmm. A knot off toenail shouldn't be hard to come by. <laughs> and now? Well, damn, did you just chew off your toenail? <laughs> you go, girl. Living your best life. Well, I don't know. Should we try and be you for a second? Uh, let's try you then. I'm really curious to see if this is gonna work. Let's see. I can't believe it. It really did work. Wow. The latch isn't held by the panel anymore. How? I can just open the door. Hey. This really is yes. our old kitchen. I can't wait to go on exploring my past. Oh no! no. We're going back. No. Damn it! No. God damn, we're just starting to have fun, man. No! Dang! It was all just about to come back to me. I'm sorry. This was all I could remember. God At least damn you it. learned how to loosen screws. That's true. Right. 
Thanks, so Harvey. Is that toenails Where on the would floor I there? be without you? Wait. Why does it say Harvey one toenails? What's that about? Well, anyway, let's unscrew these nails. That doesn't work that way. What? What do you mean? Wait, you had to crunch it? Oh, wait, what? <laughs> I'm confused. Well, whatever. Let's unscrew it. Yes! We're getting out of here, boys. Uh, we gotta stop that thing though, right? Let's try and stop it with that thing. Look here, Harvey. I've invented the world's first chair leg sharpener I don't ever. Think cool. That's cool. This would work is. great for vampire hunting. After we escape, we'll make millions. Hey, hello. Well, sweetheart, what is it now? Please turn it off. I feel a little chilly. I feel now. a little chilly now. Can you turn off the AC again, please? That'd no. Be very helpful. Fresh air is good for you. And with any luck, it'll make you drowsy. God damn it. Uh, yeah. I'd like to know more about mini golf. Maybe now well, we don't butter it up, but talk shit about it. Have I told you that I play in the professional league? Yep. Uh. And I bet <laughs> mommy bought the club for you. <laughs> Do you think that a Babbitt and Son can be bought in just any store? I don't know. <laughs> Where did you get it then? Is it from the junkyard? You can find the most curious things there. Watch your mouth! Ah. Nobody throws out a gem like a Babbitt and Son. <laughs> Where did you get it then? Did you carve it from a whale's jawbone? Ha! The whale has yet to be born. Whose jawbone can compete with the impact of a genuine bad son? I feel like very son? proud of this thing. Where did you, did you steal get it? it? Did you steal it? I think this is all very exciting. <laughs> Watch your mouth. I've never stolen anything in my life. I don't life. believe you. I give up. Where did you get it? My father made it for me. Jeffrey Francis von Babbitt Sr. Oh, man. Really? <laughs> As he lay on his deathbed with shaking hands, he handed over his own Babbitt and Son. I don't titanium believe you, actually, seven at all. Iron. <laughs> Sounds his like lucky bullcrap. club. He told me to use it like he taught me. Uh, oh, man. Why don't you take your daddy's club and whack it across your skull? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> You're mean. Hell yeah. <laughs> My poor father. Just you wait. Let's see if you're still laughing when I turn the AC oh, back off. no. Man, that's not what I wanted you to do at all. Oh, crap. Oh, well. Is it though? I might not be able to take it with me. But, I think I can pry it out of the casing if I use a bit of force. Help a lady out here, will you, Harvey? And... Come on! Ugh. Oh, thanks. So now we just leave. Yes! <laughs> yeah! Escaping! Hell yeah! This is going This great. Edna is a real challenge, Holgar. Oh man, they're That's talking Dr. about Marcel's her. voice. <gasps> It's coming from beyond this grate. It's crazy. Quick, maybe we can listen in on what they're saying. Oh, look, someone else tried to escape too. Did you what see it? What do you Did mean you by it? that, Dr. Marcel? I'm at the end of my tether. It's been ten years, and she can still remember. You're afraid she might find out what really happened back then? Pah! Nobody will believe her. Oh, Who's man. gonna believe a loony? The daughter of a convicted murderer. What? So why are you worried? I'm not worried. I just hate her resistance. I can't well, believe keep what I'm hating, hearing. bitch, cuz I'm dad? getting out of here. A murderer. There's something rotten in the state of Denmark. Yeah. This Dr. Marcel is hiding something. Oh yeah, there is. As soon as we're out of here, we'll have to clear the good name of my father. 
Yeah, let's get to that later. Look, look, look. <laughs> That's who I'm talking about. But we're not gonna end up like that because I'm gonna help you, Edna. Just slide right on through there. Freedom, cut to shreds by the merciless bars of a no. great. Why, cruel world? Uh, no, but honestly, let's, um. I don't know. Let's hit it. Freedom! Freedom! Or not. Maybe you can chew through the bars, Harvey. Do it. I'm afraid I can't. My teeth are made of terry claw. Useless. Should we go back? Go down here instead? Uh, Dr. Marcel and Hulger are gone. Then we should absolutely do that. So let's uh, chew that. And uh, I don't know, let's open it. Dr. Marcel and Hulger are gone. Then well, go down there. Here we go again. Yes. I'm starting to get the hang of this. You're getting so good, Edna. I'm so proud of you. There's a lot of shit here. Can I chew it again? That's so many toenails, man. A framed newspaper clip over the mantelpiece. That seems to be important. So take it. Now, what is this? Oh, that's your dad, isn't that's it? That's my father right there in the picture. This article states my father is a murderer. That is a horrendous lie. Oh, sorry, I was reading. Encyclopedia. Photo. An old photograph of a boy playing. I think I know him from somewhere. Okay, so that's the son that died. Because I remember he had two sons. We get to know in the next it shows game a boy that I've already smiling. played. I don't know him, but he's starting to annoy me. And he's dead. Sorry if you didn't know. Spoilers! <laughs> a masterpiece. That's definitely Dr. Marcel's distinct signature. Take it. Take everything, man. Just one take cup everything. for a spelling bee and one for shooting clay discs. How sporting. A desk made from the finest wood. Too yeah. bad there are no documents that say anything about Dr. Marcel's sinister dealings here. I'd really like to know what he's up to. You and me both, Edna. Engage fireplace. Set to 96.8 degrees Fahrenheit. Low flicker. Your request is outside the range of regular parameters. Oh, Captain, man. the voice activation is faulty, it seems. Hmm. Yes, Harvok. You are right. Mia, yeah, she just seems to be living her best life, to be honest. Yikes! Oh, no! Well... If it isn't Miss Damn Edna, it. how did you manage to get out of your cell? Uh, they, they left me out? Uh, yeah, you had to, to go to the bathroom. I had to go to the bathroom and got lost. Oh, come to Ulgor and I'll show you the way. No, get out of the here. way back to your cell. Ha! Never! It's not too late. It's not to too late to become friends. We are not your enemies, Edna. Will you stop erasing my memory and destroying my ego then? Please? Oh, um, no. Probably not. <laughs> Great friends. <laughs> What's that? Are you coming now? Uh. I'll put you back in your cell. Ha! Never! Yeah. Ha! Huh, never. never. You can't hide behind the desk forever. Oh yeah, we'll I can. see about that. Let's grab that thing. 
made from the mineral of a meteorite that crashed here. What? It's a mineral that doesn't naturally exist on Earth. True. The mallet would fit right in with my collection of tools. Grab it. Or not. Mallet. Noun. Two. A long-handled hammer-like implement for striking a ball. The pen is mightier than the sword, but the mallet is mightier than the two combined. Look here, Harvey. A polo mallet. It shall be our Excalibur now. I'd have to take it first. Then take it. Cumbersome. Actually, there's a reason why there are four control commands in the interface, Harvey. A polo mallet. Okay, now we got it. Cool. So let's just hit him in the head with that. Can we? That'd be awesome. No, I wanted to hit him. Ah! Yes! Ah, yes! Nah. He's had enough. You go, girl. You go, proud I of you. I should get rid of Holger first. Oh. Come on, we can clean up later. No. Somebody could find him and sound the alarm. True. You She's have a clever experience girl. with this kind of thing, don't you? Oh, snap. Well, that's fine. Uh, let's grab him into the... Like, get him into the cabinet. Or or the chimney, perhaps? Um. Who the champ? Who the champ? <laughs> you the champ. Say it louder! <laughs> Edna! Yeah. No, but seriously, like, what do we do with him? Could we just draw on him or some shit? Like, yes. drag him. I should get rid of him. Yes. But where to put him? Ah! <sighs> I know! Yeah. The cabinet! Absolutely. Are you strong enough for that? How the fuck did you manage to get him into the cabinet by yourself? He's a huge dude, man. I don't get- I don't, I don't buy it, but whatever. Let's go. We've made it! Yes! Take the plant. Oops. Oops! Help! Murder! Oh no! We killed it! Take the plant. Somebody else will take care of that. Fine, go in here. Good idea! That way, I can turn the light on wherever I am. Yeah! Just oh, bring no. it with you. It's attached. What oh. a bummer. Yeah, that's a bummer. They're pretty much like my own. Mmm, tastes like pineapple. Can you not take anything I here? I don't want it. It's broken. What for? There is some missing. Well, fine then. I most certainly will not lug this thing around. You're definitely not a hoarder, at least. That's good for you. Oh! Good. We got something. Yeah! Oh, can I go out to... Okay. Okay, right? I'll die. Okay, sure. Don't mind me. I'm just uh, walking along the rooftop. That's normal. I can't open it without my special well, tool. Well, do you need to, though? I don't think you do. Uh, yes, folks. It's time once again for Edna Conrad and her dancing toenails. It Hell loses some yeah. of its appeal trying to get in instead of out. Wait, so I could have done that. Well, maybe it wouldn't have worked on that side, actually. Should we go down below? Everything looks like toys from up here. But an inner voice is warning me not to take another step and make a grab for him. Whoa! A toy car! I love little dinky cars! Well, let's go back in, because I don't really know what we would do out here anyway. Let's explore the hallways a bit. 
Well, actually, maybe we can open that as well. Take Skylight? Are you trying to tell me something? Only what? someone a few watts short of a light bulb would try that, Edna. Well, fine. Hey! Uh oh, oh. I better skedaddle. Wait, you little brat! Can't catch me, bruh. Let's go out uh, to the window. Yeah. And, uh. I don't know. Aha! Caught ya! What's oh, the no. big idea walking around on your own? And how did you manage to get out of there? Wait, Let's is that go. uh to golf dude? He don't looks you like a hear golf my dude. Answer? Foolish! <laughs> You'll have to get up earlier for that. Yep. Okay, Houdini. I might not know how you managed to escape, but one thing's for yeah, sure. Yeah, because everything looks completely normal again. in here. Well, damn. So we lost. Lost. Let's uh, go down the pipe this time. I don't know. Well, I think this is a good place to end this episode because I don't feel like playing more today. So, <laughs> I mean, we managed to escape the cell. We went to the pass for a bit. We got thrown back into the... I mean, we've done so much. This save game, absolutely save game. Well, that is it for this episode. Uh, leave a like and a comment if you want to. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you in tomorrow's video where we continue to try and escape this asylum and maybe learn some more about Edna's past. Alright, well, it's been fun. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.